On February 7th, 2024, a mysterious parcel arrived at our P.O. box. It was a manila package tied with yarn, heavy, stained, and manhandled, ripped in enough places to show the reams of paper bundled inside. Carefully peeling off the packaging revealed hundreds of handwritten pages. At the top of the stack rested a ripped sheet of lined paper, a concise cover letter that read as follows. To whom it may concern, my name is Lana Terrigan. These are my memoirs. You may find them interesting. Every word is true. You may clean up my handwritten mess as needed, distribute them however you will, but leave nothing out. Not that I could stop you. By the time anyone out there reads this, I will be ashes and dirt. Please tell my story. I'm sick of keeping secrets. Lana. Looking closer, the sheets appeared to be photocopies of notebook pages, exhaustively spread over a copier plate one by one. It stands to reason many other copies were sent out, especially considering White Moth Press is in business exclusively to publish my own novels. We're not precisely a big-name publishing house. I couldn't have been Miss Terrigan's first choice, but the few publishing houses that replied to my request for information complained of understaffing and years-old slush piles. None of them confirmed receiving a copy, so we jumped at the chance. Miss Terrigan's memoir claims to be a true story, but this becomes hard to believe only a few pages in. This is, in fact, a fantasy novel. An engaging, fun, romantic urban fantasy full of magic and, boy, does Miss Terrigan enjoy describing her sexual escapades. The amount of explicit content found in her supposed life experiences makes it a rough fit for Israel's team catalog, but we feel enormously compelled to publish it nonetheless. So, that being said, we'd like to stress this novel is for adults only. These are Lana Terrigan's alleged memoirs authored by Miss Derrigan herself and copied, cleaned up, arranged, published, yet in no way otherwise edited by White Moth Press. Enjoy the ride. We certainly did.